Hello and welcome to the stream. Today, I'm going to show you how to get Darkness Falls and Sorcery to play together. And I'm going to do this using the Mod Launcher. It is the easiest way to get this done. So uh, what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and open up the Mod Launcher here. And I always advise to start with a new location when you're uh, downloading Darkness Falls. So I have changed the default location to test game location alpha 19. And then I'm going to go over here to uh, Darkness Falls. And the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to have it copy an existing game copy. So Darkness Falls right now is on 19.2 uh, stable. Current version is 3.2. So by doing this right here, it's going to make a copy of the game just for Darkness Falls in that directory um, there you see right here. So I can have a separate file for this game. So I'm going to go ahead and do this. So this does take a little while. So while this is loading, um, I'm just going to skip through all this part and come back when this is done. All right, so Darkness Falls is done being downloaded. You can tell here there's no more information going on down here. So the mod is ready to play by itself just by hitting play mod button. But we're not going to do that. We're going to go ahead and close the mod launcher right now. Now, right now I am on the sorcery discord page. This is where you can find these directions. And this is also where you can find the download links for the sorcery mod itself, which is exactly what we're going to use right now. So we're going to download sorcery first. Uh, real simple. Click the button, let it load. It is downloading down here at the bottom. Okay, it is done downloading. 340 megabytes, it looks like. So we're going to open this file up. Okay, so we have now downloaded the sorcery master file and the directions, which let me move this around right here, is really you only want the single folder sorcery uh, found within the zip file here. So we want just this file right here. So we're going to copy that right there, and then we're going to move that to the Darkness Falls download game file. So we're going to go here, Darkness Falls, we're going to go to Mods, and we're going to paste it right here. 499 files, or items I should say. All right. So now we have, well, it's not quite done yet, but now we have the Sorcery mod downloaded. The next step, as you can see here, is downloading the compatibility patch. Um, that's going to make the two work together. It makes a few tweaks to the sorcery mod um, to make sure it's compatible with Darkness Falls. Very, very key. So we're going to click this to download it. All right. It's a very small file. OK, so we want both of these right here. So basically the whole thing. So we're just going to go ahead, extract it all. We're going to change the directory um, to this one right here. Hit select folder, an extract, only a few short files. We're going to go ahead and replace the file here. Okay, so that is done. We're going to close off that window there. We're going to go back to, we now have the sorcery, the sorcery compatibility, Darkness Falls. All right. And Darkness Falls here. We should be good to go. Verify the directories. All right. So now what we're going to do is we're just going to go back to here. And we're going to click on the executable here inside. Instead of going to the mod launcher, I have multiple copies of the game. So I always, depending on what version I want to play, I go straight to the executable instead of launching off of Steam or off of the mod launcher. So we're going to go here. And this is probably going to take a little while to load. Um, but we'll see. So I'm going to go ahead and load up Seven Days to Die Darkness Falls with Sorcery. All right, so the basic game loads first. Then Darkness Falls and Sorcery should take over in a few seconds. All right. Here you go. You now have Sorcery and Darkness Falls ready to play together. You should see up here in the corner Alpha 19.2 with 
sorcery version 0.922 and modded with darkness falls here version 3.2 so there you go that is how you get darkness falls to play with a uh, sorcery mod it is a lot of fun and i highly recommend that uh, if you like this video and you want to see some gameplay of at least the sorcery mod i don't have any gameplay yet with darkness falls but i will but go ahead and subscribe to the channel like if this video helped you out because i do want it to help others because this is a great combination all right Thanks a lot for tuning in, and I'll catch you on next time.